Yang berbahagia Datuk Dr. Lokman Hakim bin Sulaiman, Deputy Director General of Health, Public Health Ministry of Health. Um, John Peter Kools, Chair, Harm Reduction International. Thanks, John. Assistant. Um, Madam Ruth Drive First, Commissioner Global Commission on Drug Policy. Dr. Rick Lines, um, Executive Director, Harm Reduction International. Um, Professor Dr. Adiba Kamaruzaman, Chairman of Malaysian AIDS Foundation. I've got here Mr. Steve Cross, but I don't see him anyway, but I'll still mention that. Um, Director of UNA's Regional Support Team for Asia and Pacific Delegates, Distinguished Guests, Ladies and Gentlemen. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh and um, good afternoon to everybody. Now, Datuk Dr. Raj Karim, uh, Malaysian AIDS Council President, have asked me to um, give this speech on her behalf because she was thinking that she was going to be late, but Datuk is sitting down there and she still wants me to give a speech on her behalf. I'm more than happy in, um, to give her speech actually on behalf. Now, um, allow me to deliver the closing remarks on her behalf. Now, this past week has been remarkably assuring. It has reminded us of many vast and fast, um, on how vast and fast the human reduction, the harm reduction, I'm not reading properly now. Butterflies in my stomach yeah. probably that took, but we'll get away with it. Um, vast and half, vast and fast, there you go again the harm reduction movement and response have expanded across all regions. The growing evidence base to guide our response to HIV and other drug harms and the inspiring leadership on all levels. In stark contrast to our progress, people who use drugs continue to be criminalized and subjected to human rights violations. Drug control policies fail to recognize, let alone protect the health and welfare of the people who use drugs. Access to hepatitis C treatment remains criminally limited. Women, young people, and other marginalized groups who use drugs remain hidden and voiceless, and gaps in the access to harm reduction services continue to exist. Ladies and gentlemen, now, as we prepare the um, upcoming UN General Assembly special seating, which is Angus, on drugs in 2016, get this paste. What we hope we have achieved as co-hosts of the 24th International Harm Reduction Conference is offering the platform to further the advance, the paradigm shift in the global drug policy and the discourse around the death penalty and other punitive laws for drug offenders that are still in effect in most parts of the countries in the world, particularly in this region. On behalf of my colleagues in Malaysian AIDS Council, I wish to thank our wonderful partners of Harm Reduction International, led by Dr. Rick Lines. Yep. For bringing this conference back to Asia after six years and joining us in reflecting on a decade of harm reduction in Malaysia. We hope the partnership and extends beyond the conference as we continue to pursue a greater agenda in harm reduction. I personally wish to acknowledge the hard work and dedication of the local organizing uh, conference com team of the Malaysian AIDS Council led by J Jasmine um, Jalil. <laughs> Somewhere there just now I saw him. I think he's been tremendous likes of not, not sleeping actually for the past couple of weeks, um, who has been working tirelessly day and night to put together what we hope to be the most memorable um, international harm reduction conference yet. Congratulations team, you certainly did us proud. To our local partners, sponsors, donors and supporters, we couldn't, think, we could, we couldn't thank you enough for your contributions, the Ministry of Health Malaysia, especially Dr. Shari, of the HIV STD sector. Thank you very much, Dr. Shari. I think you've been in the forefront. Without you, definitely, I think the conference would be very different. Um, the Malaysian uh, Convention and Established Bureau, um, MySAP, Yayasan Sandabi, Department of Islamic um, 
Department of Islamic Department Malaysia, JAKIM, Royal Malaysian Police, National Anti Dada Anti Drug um, Agencies, AADK, Ministry of um, Foreign Affairs, Malaysian Airport Berhad. Immigration Department of Malaysia, Royal Malaysian Customs Department, Center of Excellence for Research in AIDS, which is Cheria, being led by Professor Adiba, um, Malaysian Welfare Association of Recovering Drug Users, WARDU, ICLAS, Indivua, the Royal, um, the Royal Cholan, Kuala Lumpur, and many, many more. The list is never ending, actually. We hope you enjoyed the conference and had a pleasant day stay in Kuala Lumpur and look forward to welcoming you again in the future. We wish all our foreign delegates a safe journey back home and hope to see you again at the next International Harm Reduction. Thank you very much.